Hello, gamers! How's everybody doing? How are we? Are we doing well? I hope so. Hmm. There's some water on my desk. It's from yesterday. Not too bad. Maybe a little dusty. But overall okay, I think. Anyway, shall we get started? Oh, let me turn my phone. Is anyone there? Ooh, bonjour. Bonjour. Thank you, really subsumed. Thank you for the 31 months. I appreciate it and wish mods didn't have to. Hello! How are we doing? How are we feeling? I'm warm, but I have my fan pointing right on me. Crank it up a level. What do we say? Oh, hello, Castle Logical. Hello, friends. How's everybody doing? My hair is drying somewhat. I was in the sun earlier, which I think helps. Anyway, happy Monday! I... We'll say this at the end of the stream too, but I'll say it now as well. I got part-time work, which is good, but this week I'm like doing onboarding and all that stuff and getting sort of used to it, a lot of meetings. Um, so my schedule is going to be weird. And then once I settle into the job, my schedule might also change again. So that's all to say, I'm not totally sure of this week's schedule and I'm hopeful it'll go back to normal going forward, but I'm not totally sure. Um, hello, Jordan. Happy to have you. Hello, unused cow. Howdy to employment indeed. Um, uh, congrats, thank you. Hair Metal Elysium. I feel like this is a joke, but I'm missing something. Also, should we talk about the Nintendo Direct? Let me see. I'm trying to remember if there's anything that I was like, cool. There's that Princess Peach game, and I want to be excited about it, but I kind of don't care. There's Splatoon 3 DLC, which is exciting, even though I haven't played Splatoon in a minute. I don't really care about Paper Mario. Sorry, sue me. Same with the Mario vs. Donkey Kong. Or Mario RPG. The Another code or whatever. I Source code, is that what it was? I played that game so much on the DS. So I am actually a little bit excited for that one. Um, it looks like maybe just a port. I have never gotten into Trombone Champ. I'm gonna keep it real. I am excited about WarioWare Move It. Um, I think Luigi's Mansion is charming. Excited for Mario Maker Deluxe. I'm looking down the list. This is all to say, um, I wasn't like so thrilled and excited, but I didn't hate it. You know what I mean? Those are my thoughts on the matter. Boop. F-099, do you like it? I don't think I've ever played an F-Zero game. And I don't think I care. Those are my thoughts. Is it like a Battle Royale F-Zero? The 99 is what makes me think that. Wow, my hair's looking light. I guess I have been spending time in the sun. Oh. Really looking reddish. Pretty much. Well, that's cool. I hope people are excited. It's so good, and I never played an F-Zero game as well. Okay, is it already out? Battle Royale F-Zero. Oh, hold on. Well said, Professor Ticklebits. Hope you're enjoying teaching the class. F-099, may the fastest pilot win. Here, we can take this over to here and pop over to Bink. All right, what do we got? Oh my God. This is loco. That's pretty funny. They should do Mario Kart 99. Whoa. Well, that's fun. Also, the voiceover for all of these is loco. Oh, sorry, no sound? Interesting. 
Oh, I see. I've cranked the volume completely low. Power meter for a temporary speed boost. Sorry about that. Um, anyway. You can also collect super sparks, which appear when so machines collide, to boost up to a special path called the Feels Skyway. No it's your best chance at bypassing your rivals oh, nice. and jumping into a higher position. Wow. Complete goals Beautiful. while you're racing to unlock cosmetic options for your machine. Free download if you have Nintendo Online. I never played Tetris 99 either. Perhaps at one point I'll check this out. Not today, not today. 99 players, one winner. It's time to race your way to first place. Ooh. Because F-099 will be available exclusively for active Nintendo Switch Online members later today. My audio is low compared to the trailer. Yes, I know. Let's hop into the game. Why don't we? Um, I'm intrigued by that F-099. But will I actually play it? I'll also say I played a little bit of Disco Elysium uh, off stream. Very little. Basically, I talked to the lady on the boat a bit, the rich lady on the boat, and she was like, what'd she say? Cheater, I know. Sue me, posh dolphin. Freaking sue, okay? I'll see you in court. Um, I talked to the posh lady on the boat, and she was like, she wants me to do some kind of like, insider trading drug deal or something and Tim was like hey don't do that and I'm like okay I won't do that um and then I talked to a guy on a balcony and then he was like I don't really want to talk to you in the way that nobody wants to talk to me but then he showed he like pointed to a rock in front of that door and that, then I went to the building now I'm exploring the building I talked to the kid Cindy door is locked I can't get in Fair is new someone lives back here well, okay, then. I think I came out through here. Go in through there. Anyways, it's Cindy. She doesn't like me. That's a-okay. Oh, also, I have this alcohol that I don't want. I want to throw it away. But I don't know how. And I have these glasses that I'm wearing. Um, I've decided to wear the gloves, too, because why not? I have the postcard that I don't know what to do with. And I've looked at the picture of the tattooed guy. So. <laughs> okay, this old lady wants me to like yell at somebody in one of these units. Uh, oh. Oh no, exit? I don't want the exit. We're gonna talk to them again. I think this old lady's like, they're squatting. You hear someone walking around inside, rearranging the furniture. The number on the panel says, I'm kind of like, hey, you can vibe in here, but I gotta get to the you bottom. You with me? Of course not. You have plenty of reason to enter. Um, then open the door so I can verify. I don't like doing cop shit, oh, but come here we are. Well, that was easy. That was smart. Okay, we're walking in, I guess. Hello. Satisfied? My okay. name is Marielle Charpentier, and I'm an agent with Martinez Realty Associates. I am not breaking in, as I have every right to be here. The keys, see? Her voice is really cheerful, despite her obviously hating you. Do you want to see my ID as well? You can't legally ask for it, but why not? Want to see my residence permit, too? Um... I need your idea. I just need to ask you something. Very well, but please make it quick. I need to be back in La Delta in an hour. Who lived in the foreclosed apartment down the oh, hallway? Oh, that's another huge mess. The former tenant owes us three months of rent. Three. We closed the apartment and planned on auctioning off the valuables, but... And again, I have no idea how stupid mistakes like this can even happen. But Ron, when he came to close the door, didn't close the neighboring door. And there's a hole in the wall. A hole in the wall. Can you believe it? And then the tenant ran off with his stuff. He's gone. She a robot the, the way she talks. Gone. Just like that. That's wild. The sum must have been puny. Oh, it irks her. The incompetence. 
Uh, could have been that much money. The apartments look pretty shabby. These apartments are perfectly fine. They have gorgeous architecture, a million real view of the bay, good ventilation, neighbors, life, sparks, and they are affordable. I'll tell you, Martinez has a future. In a few years, it's going to blossom with artists and creatives and those radio computer wizards. Don't ask me what happened with the wall. I have no idea how we're going to find the time or resources to fix it. You lost your COVID vaccination card? I will say no one has asked in a long time. But I also have, like, one on my phone. Both apartments are now unrentable. Let me get my booster. Both. Damn, we're supposed to do it this weekend, and we forgot. I'm really... Uh, what? What are you doing here? I need to get it ready for the next lease, but as you can see, the previous tenant completely trashed the place. Sounds like they knew how to have a good time. It was some kind of a moribund old man who used to be a business owner. You'd think they'd make rent, but... That was months ago. Anyway, was there anything you wanted, or is that it? That's I'm up all. For it. Right. Talk to the cleaning lady, and I'm going to. Oh. One to indirect modes of taxation. What? Um. Why not? I like taking booze, etc. Like a fine mattress. Active medication for the box. You should take it. All right. Of my morale. I think it's all right that I'm feeling constantly. All right, old woman. Turn up. Give me a moment. Um, didn't find any counterculture people at real estate agent. I see. I hope some good people are finally going to move in. This place needs them. Um, no one's coming. Nothing to squalor unless you start killing real estate agents. Pretty sure everything will be fine. Needs flow change. Sure. Yes. Well, <clears throat> I hope they're good people. Your statements are too vague to comment on. All right. Well, I'm off. This is the guy on the balcony, but we haven't been up to that balcony yet, so I don't want to start asking around yet. Working for a real estate lawyer who deals with realtors, this energy is spot on for some of them. That's funny. I believe it. Oops, what are we that isn't at? just a five-pointed star. It's an inverted white pentagram cradled in a wreath of antlers. The iconography of communism, in other words. The star and antlers was developed in the sixth decade of the last century and quickly adopted by Mezov and the communards during the revolution. Even today, Half a century after, the star and antlers retains the ability to evoke hope, disappointment, and fear in equal measure. To symbolize the toppling of the old order, also some social democrats were already using it. The wreath of antlers represents a natural crown. It was about building a society that could exist in accord with the natural world, and at the same time, above it because white is the color of peace nothing at all yet right now it's just meaningless shapes on a wall all right then this door has been closed with a padlock the chalk drawn number Ooh, on the board says it. number 11. I have good reason to for that room right now so i'm not going to Go to this balcony. Oop. Box is full of cigarette butts and electric wires. Look around, what else what is in here? Okay. Just the door. Ugh, oh, hurry up. Ooh, money. Run! Yeah. 
Okay, I prefer to be remembered. Bottles. Hmm. Can I get up there? Well, perhaps we should ask the old lady about the guy on the balcony after all. I want to get up here. Tim, give me a boost. Okay. Old lady! Give me a moment. Yes, Looking yes. For the young man. I know who you mean. The scrawny boy who's always smoking like the devil. Somewhere in the building, a child starts crying. You hear a radio tuned to a talk show okay. and someone taking a shower. What's he in trouble for? No trouble. Talk? <laughs> what was so funny about that? He lives upstairs in room 28. Go to the balcony. It's one of those doors. Thank you. We should go check out his apartment on the balcony. See if he's home. Catch you later, old bag. This door has been closed. Like, is this see through? The chalk tell. drawn number on the board says. <laughs> Tempting to put it open, but I don't think I actually have a reason to do that. Trying to be a good person. Those oh yeah, I got fresh shoes. My shoes better. What do you want? Open. Knock, knock. This door is made of metal and appears to be reinforced. Number 28. This is where the cleaning... Let's see if anyone's home. Knock on the door. No one answers. Looks like the young man we are looking for isn't home. I think our best chance to catch him is in the evening. Six. We should return tomorrow after we have finished with our day's work. How about 9 p.m.? Sound okay. good? Sounds good. Tomorrow, 9 p.m., right here. Apartment number 28. Good. Let's go. Damn. Turns out it's quite tricky finding someone in a big apartment building. Don't worry. Remember, tomorrow, he's probably gone for today. Well, what do I do until tomorrow? I'm freaking up here. Me up there. This thing. Go grab it. Hmm. All right. Well, we're moving on. Trying to decide if I should use those bolt cutters on that one door. I'll leave for now. Let's go drop off some bottles. See how much money we can get. Get into here. A new the jacket. I want this. We get up there. Run. Oh, Ariosis. First playthrough. Mm, yes, it is. Kid, I'm making you do this work again. Every snowflake is like a little gift from the. Alright, bye, Annette. A weirdo. Look through your trash. I like the snow, this is pleasant. I guess I'm progressing time in the right way if it's 
Weather's changing. Use the machine. The tear machine stands in the corner. Your bottles clunk into the machine, and the money. What? That's it. Well, I'm on my way. Oh, it's just the lack of bottles, I guess. Two negative two. Skin through the noses. Okay, so I'm. My outfit's too good. Okay, minus one to authority. You know what? I'll take. Minus one to suggestion. All right. Okay, your favorite voice is Shivers. And I am. Um. I don't know where to go next. descent has only worsened since I last saw you. You have really let yourself go. Try to knock him out. That doesn't feel like a good solution. I don't really know what else to do, though. Get my notebook. Okay. Did I not? I thought he did this. Tell yes. me about the case. What do you want to know? Um, uh, anything. Ah, yes. The kid, three days ago, the okay, arson during that time. The victim had been stripped of his belongings. Okay, a security was. guard or worker of some sort hired by Wellbine. He didn't the identify collar. himself. Why There's a strong himself? prejudice against involving the RCM in what seen as union matters. The dock workers union is the de facto find the killer. Okay. Um... All I Good. need. Okay. Armored gloves, little girl, down the coast. With the armored gloves. The rest of the armor. Okay, we gotta go to Kuno. To get the body down. Um. Badge. Shoes. Collar. Find a way to the secret passage. Yoki, I'm working on it. You load down. Armor piece. This. Yeah. You know what? I've done a lot too. So we should feel good about that. Woo! Alright. I don't have a favorite inner voice quite yet. See if anybody has anything new to say, you know. I can't believe it's snowing again. It felt like springtime just a few days ago. Oh, okay. I got a skill point. All right, great. Thanks for keeping me in the know. They're working on getting it down, my friend. Um, I don't know what to. Right now. We could go look in the mirror and see if we can stop smiling. Usually I put my points into what I need in the immediate moment. Hello again, sweetie. Alright, gotta get going. I'm not gonna say any of those loco bananas things. Not useful, but that's fine. Okay, have we talked to you? I think so, but we'll do it again. The door is closed. Still no answer. Still nothing. The lieutenant gives you. A, he doesn't like where this is going. Okay, I'm sorry. Ooh, bottle. Hey, 
cleaning up my room. The bed is cold. At the mirror. Out of my way, Kim. The mirror hangs on the bathroom wall. In it, your face adorned Interfacing. with expression. Electrochemistry. Oh, we'll start with there. I do need to... Facing. Hmm. Okay, electrochemistry is Party Planet Love and Beloved by Drugs. Okay, I'm not really that interested in doing that one. Interfacing is probably useful. Master Machines, Pick Locks and Pockets. I'm going to try this one. Okay, we're going to level you up. Then we're going to get out of this. Here be. Um, tools. Bolt cutters. Hold on. Map. Map. Oh, this is like stuff to... I see, I see. Well, that's cool. That's a useful thing. Hm. Okay. A mirror hangs on the bathroom wall. Okay, In interfacing. Your face. Best adorned. luck. With the, the chain cutters Damn. slip out of your hands as you attempt to twist right. the faucet. Oh. Are ready for that one yet? Get this bottle? Yes, I can. Take Oop, bottles. I'm gonna clean up a room really quick. I don't know what else to do. Like a bottle, but maybe pictures not oh here we go. Take Kim is very patient. Okay. Heading down. I put your bottles for you. I had intellect to start. Immediately got killed by the ceiling fan. That's fun. All right, Kuno, we gotta talk. You lied to me, oh, child. Kuno here? No. Hold me. Kuno did sick the pigs on him. Kuno's a man of his word. Kuno sent your fat ass running around like jello. Look, pig. Kuno sent you to rough some people up. Kuno played you. That happened. Now you and Kuno should move on. Good idea. Um, yes. yes Let's move that's on. That's what Kuno said. Don't be saying what Kuno said back to Kuno. Get the fuck out of here, pal. After Why this shit, so mean to me? you better have something real interesting to say if you want to stay in Kuno's face. Yeah, real in Kuno. Bye, doesn't Kuno. Fucking... You can give this in. The man before you is naked. But... Can you talk about getting him down yes, again? Yes, we do. Maybe we could shoot him down? Yeah, bang bang time, pig. Shoot you. Hull. Where the buckle ties the rope to the branch, that's a good spot to aim. There, the buckle holds the belt together. Where? Ah, yes, I see. If the shot hits that, there might be a chance to release the belt. Yeah, now we're talking. Entertain. Don't miss. The pigs will miss Kuno. Hmm. I'll let him choose. Silence. With his elbow sharp. The lieutenant unzips his jacket and produces a lightweight firearm. He drops a paper cartridge in the barrel, separates the scouring stick, and gives the cartridge five tucks, securing it in place. That's a Kiel A1990 armistice, mass-produced muzzle loader, a setting okay. for... He then steps back and assumes the fellow's stess position, taking aim. The corner of his eye twitches, his finger is on the trigger. If he does it, 
The kissed voice is drowned in a shrill blast that echoes off the walls of the surrounding tenements. A cloud of smoke slowly parts oh. in the- God damn it. Oops, I have not said anything. He feels bad about it. About his eyes, mostly. Just having bad eyesight. Oh. Probably from a young age. Kuno could have hit it easy, but then Kuno is not fucking handicapped, is he? I guess. No, we are lucky as it is. We didn't break anything. Any more mistakes could put us in an unfortunate position with the locals. Okay. We have eyes on us. I didn't. But I have now. to say, it's beginning to look unlikely we can get him down without assistance. I could try. Does seem not smart. But I'm gonna say it anyway. It's bad as it is. Us shooting firearm. Yeah, Go that's ahead. Fair. I'm not oh, stopping. Oh shit! All right. They only have. This is the sorriest. Yeah, take it, you fucking banana pointer. Um, let's feel the weight first. The cold piece of bakelite and gunmetal is surprisingly. The fuck are you waiting for, Kuno? Tell it to gun. The buckle comes into focus in your sights. You Get the gloves on. Is that gonna help? Planted firmly. Why don't you just shoot yourself in your fucking mouth? At least you won't miss. Um. Close your left eye. Your field of view narrows. The branch slowly moves, becoming entirely two-dimensional. The metal buckle glimmers, catching the noon light as the corpse slowly rotates. The slow movement of the branch in the wind and your shoulders directing the gun. Look, he's crying. You gonna cry now, fucking faggoty? Um, shall I tell her to shut up? Or what? You gonna fuck me? Then point the gun at her. Is but I'm not going about? to. Okay. I have a feeling we're not gonna get this one. Unless I give the gun back. I agree. Enough okay. gunslinging for today. What about the body? We need to access the harbor and ask the leader of the union to have it taken down. They have the tools, and they have men. Okay. Well... <sighs> I bet... We probably could've... Yeah. An inconspicuous pile of the roofing material eaten up. Try it. Because there's a secret door hidden behind the panels I knew it! Tonight. There it is. You see a shabby little door. Great. Hopefully we can bypass all the union shit. What I is do this love that I'm just carrying around a bag full of shed? bottles this whole time. Let's investigate. Please no. Woo! Be still, my beating heart. It's amphetamine. The lieutenant isn't studying the powder in the mirror. He's, there's a good, vague way to ask where he stands on drug use. Professionally, I mean. Um, I'm gonna say someone's taking narcotics here. Perhaps not. This is below our pay grade, detective. However, see that ladder there? It's probably another way into the industrial harbor, no? Right. Don't mind if I do. It's been gratifying to shoot. I want to threaten. Have this. What a long journey to get up there. Why you do that? Calm down, down everybody. card looks like someone left his tarpaulin cloak hanging on the railing here 
Okay. Yes, it's probably yours. It bears the RCM insignia, oh. and you have a habit of being careless with your equipment. You could probably make the jump. You look like you've done some track and field in your day. Um, look around. The wind is aggressive up here. The lieutenant looks at the enormous crane towering in the distance over the container yard. The look in his eyes is a mix of an engineer-like interest and the wonder of a six-year-old seeing a horse for the first time. That machine okay. is a Kvalsund 1020 HK. Is it? Kvalsund makes a lot of heavy equipment, but this is phenomenal, even for them. But I digress. We were focusing on your cloak here. I was under the assumption we could ask the leader of this unit, or it could be that he's thinking you've forgotten where you are again. Oh. Let's say white check. Let's go for it. All right, ready, everyone? See how we do. Still too high. What? Sure. Just be careful, okay? Looks like you almost strained the muscle there. All right, not right now. <sighs> Down. More of this. Long till I level up again. Fifteen of a hundred. It's gonna take freaking forever. Hmm. So this way can't do anything until I level up potentially. Trains yourself? Cool. Trains are also cool. Okay, well, I guess I'm going back through here. It's too hard sometimes. This kid away. I'll oh. die before I squeal, pig. Hey, kid. What's this kid shit? Fucking get the fuck out of here. <sighs> All right. If you were me, where would you go? Hmm. Inside, you see a set of steering levers, a radio microphone, a pull-out toolbox, and... The worn and beaten wooden plank. Hmm. We can sit on benches after we've sold... You can revisit the bench. If you ever need to pass, I know. I don't know what to do. Here's a new person to talk to. There are clothes inside, cheap second-hand clothes. Smelling of strangers' body odors. Don't be shy. These are premium class clothes. Good quality fabric. Best retro design. At this point, not necessarily. That sounds off. Uh, it seems like I have more to explore, so I'm gonna explore. 
Let me browse the box. You find your hands deep in tattered and faded garments made economical but also trendy. Look for find hands. something worth buy second hand. Oh, but keep the economy moving. No good. All you can come up with are some treated wool pants. You can tell they're too tight around your thighs and too loose around the waist. Touch them. They itch. All natural materials. See? Real wool, 100% okay. skin friendly. Haven't the you economy? heard of it? We've got to be economically conscious. Ris, look around, officer. You see all these premium goods just sitting there, not getting bought? We've got to keep the flow of goods moving. Is this really the economy we want to leave to our um. children? I'm gonna say we gotta save mother That's economy. We've all got to do our Don't want these bad pants though. You see two lowly defeated speakers, thralls, slaves basically, perched. I can see you were tasteful luxury officer. Back to the sneakers. A pair of found ultras. The design is impossibly sleek and simple. Those sneakers, Mister. Those sneakers are the latest. Only? That's madness. Found Ultra. We're the future. Thanks. These once respectable speakers have been conquered. Reduced to a No, no. Don't look at the speakers, officer. Look at the sneakers. The sneakers are the stars here. What about the speakers? Hey, poor little speakers. No, don't pity them, officer. These are old Sam Samaran trash. That sounds like they're from the Samaran People's Republic, produced under the dictatorship of the proletariat. By the sad... No way, officer! These aren't for sale. They're bad speakers. Lo-fi socialist junk. Um... No, officer. You're a high-class policeman who accepts nothing less than the best. I want the Lucky speakers! Friends, if you want them, but see... They are the pedestal for my sneakers. If I let go of the speakers, well, if, on the other hand, you wanted to buy the sneakers too, I could... Damn, so you have to buy the sneakers first. can't afford the sneakers. I'm poor. Hey, psst. Who, me? Yes, you. Word on the street is you're ready to start building communism again. How come there's word you on the keep street? saying things like, down with the bourgeoisie, eat the rich, sodomize the landowners, impel all people who have more than 25 real in their pockets, literally murder all human beings regardless of their political beliefs. That kind of stuff. It's some, but none of those. Oh yes, the mass of ambivalence. Don't deny it. You're about to rip it off and reveal the monstrous seven-eyed lamb of global communism that would devour and masticate mankind. Everyone can see that. So tell me, do you have any questions before we fire up the big communism? What is communism dinner? even about? Failure. It's about failure. Failure? Yes. Abject failure. Total irreversible defeat on all fronts. Absolutely vanquished. Beaten curb stomped and pissed you alone against every living thing against every human alive 800 trillion real in the hands of an in you against the atom the charm and the spin where the whole world failed matter failed to bend to human will human will fail to get out of bed and tie its laces you alone single-handedly we rebuild the dreams of the working class. Now get to work, comrade. Um. All right. Oh yeah, get the firing squads and the animal wagons ready. Say what? Too late to back out now. You can't make an omelet without breaking a few million eggs. All right. Uh, well, here we go. Think. Talk to you. What's you the see deal? a Samaran street vendor surrounded by a motley. The name Silen. Happy shopping, officer. Everything's cool here. Everything's cool. 
the good. You're very cool. Bang, 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 bang. Hey, really? You think I'm cool? Oh, yes. You got style. You like premium menswear. Look around. Don't be distracted by the flattery and funny man act. Questions. That's Only the selling. coolest goods in Revashol. I've got sneakers, speakers, extremely comfy pants. To... I'm an entrepreneur, officer. I've got sources, buyers, suppliers, distributors, manufacturers, wholesalers. All extremely cool and above board. Fair discount for no me? No need for discounts at ceilings, officer. Everything's already on sale. But did he first mark them up 100%? Just so that he could put them on sale? No use prying. Yes, it's a business secret. Let him keep it. Right. Let me ask you something Anything else. Anything for you. Where are you from? Me? It's a boring story, officer. This man probably comes from Seagai, sometimes known as the Apricot Suzerainty, an archipelago in the Samara Isola. Um, I'm scared to ask this and seem like I'm an anti-immigrant or something. But I'm Apricot gonna ask. Suzerainty calls to mind an era when the Sea Guy Archipelago was colonized by Revachol. Oh. It's a bit of a slur, in other words. Um. Okay. Uh, neither of you. I feel like. Neither feels good. I'm gonna say don't fret, let him answer. That's right, like, officer. Set me up for that it's one. It's a bad scene for business there. Too many regulations. Extremely bad for an independent local entrepreneur. Hey, why not support this local entrepreneur? You can start by buying a pair of sexy pants or cool sunglasses. Maybe some makeup. No need to dress yeah. this one up. Just tell him what you want. Shit. Ew. Not what I wanted. I goofed up. Oops. Oh, okay. But why, um, officer? Ah, yes. Are you trying to ask for a bribe? No. Sorry, detective. I'm sorry. I didn't read this before I clicked it. It was highlighted. Duh. Ugh. Oink. Do we have any gold boxes? There's a pile of cheap sunglasses. You like sunglasses, officer? I've got the latest styles. Right here. Well, These are hideous. What's more? Damn, officer! You look like a mega secret spy. Very secret. No, you are definitely not buying those. <laughs> You're right. Are you sure? But they look so good on you. These are all boring. Bo those UV stickers are almost certainly just there for the show. If anything. These are all first rate sunglasses. Premium design. Try again. Super material. Woo! No voiceover for this one? Okay. Oh, very interesting choice, officer. This is how a sea monster sees the world. You've become a sea. Yes. But they also make your soul quiver like jello. Wow, officer. You look so cool. I like this guy. I'm sure that means it'll be like bad later on in the game or something. And but... They can be yours for a mere three real. Tim, what do you think? The lieutenant tilts his head and steps back, eyes narrowed in a thorough examination. It's a case to him. You look like a musician, like a blind musician, but you could do worse. Take them if you want. I'm taking them. A man who knows his style. Yeah, it's fun to just buy something, you know? <laughs> Let me do a little pick me up. Nice. Well, that's fun. The Inland Empire. It feels punches and gut feelings. Okay. Go through the sewers. All right, what do we got? Dumpster? Hmm. Okay. A 
couple of indicator lights are missing from this control panel. Loose wires dangle from the now vent. This panel usually closes the water lock, turning it into a bridge that lets you cross the canal. But there's a crashed Samarin butter sign in the way. Pulling the lever probably won't do anything. Good day to you, officers. A burly man hangs out by the water lock, carving up a generous serving Yum. of salami with an old hunter's knife. Salami? His eyes are fixed on a man stranded on the other side of the water lock and on an you know enormous this I wasn't here to witness it, but those look like tire tracks on that sign. Weird, what? huh? The words, Daredevil Driver. Too bad it also takes a year and a day to repair anything around here. Especially a water lock. The rest of the coast is closed off till then. That's not slimy. Sure thing. Want Thanks, some man. too, officer? Why not? Yeah, nice. That's fun. You know what's further down the coast? Well, there's the fishing village, an abandoned fish market, a bizarro church. Not much use to the congregation, though. There always seems to be something wrong with it. Yeah, not really much else. Just... Okay. So... A rusting control panel. This panel... Pull the lever. You pull the lever all the way up until the nothing happens. Push. Oh, I'll release it. A spring brings the lever back to its original position. You still need to close the water lock to get across the canal. Wasn't there a sign over there saying functionality will be restored on Wednesday morning? Martinez streetlight sits among assorted floor and table lamps. The light pole has been carefully cut and the wiring has been redone and attached to a standard indoor plug. The, this would make quite a statement in your living room. How much for the streetlight? 700 real. A bargain, I dare say. Hmm. There's also the matter of rewiring, but the most important transformation is the light's placement among ordinary indoor fixtures. Oh, that's fine. The boom boxes on the shelf look well, love, it's and what one especially catches your eye. Deep gold, this is you. Golden orange, a sunset suite. Just make sure it works before you buy it. Here's all in Absolutely. working order. I've tested each one myself with recordings of speech, found sounds and music from a variety of genres. You see rows of toys. Try to find something pretty and cool here, then use it to win her back. Win her back? Yes. This sounds off. You should cool. try. Why? What's this? A headless man riding a horse. A headless man wearing futuristic tracksuit trousers that say foul. Oh, that's the headless phone rider. Oop. The headless phone rider. It's an urban legend. 50 cents. Bargain price. I'll throw in the tiny cap too. I think he's looking for it. Or Did I mention that this figurine is supposed to be lucky? Always carry it with you. Hmm. Well, I tried. For my bag. Hello, are you enjoying your it's tiny... It's not often that I see officers oh. from the RCM. And what can I do? His courtesy is not insincere, but... He prefers being alone with his projector, just watching the movement of light across the wall. I feel wall. like I'm interrupting. Oh no, not at all. Who are your customers usually? All kinds of people come through here. Love, as you can see, 
I have a wide selection of goods for everyone to choose from. You're quite the collection. It keeps me entertained. Hmm. I like to. Oh. We don't have any guns. Someone else came here earlier today asking the same question. This is a pawn shop, and it did feel as if you've met before. The lieutenant shifts from one foot to another, alert. Uh, was the buyer a policeman too? She didn't seem like a policeman, although she kept referring to herself as a pig, which was odd. I wonder I found if it's her uh, interest in Cindy. The gun. Truth be told. Right, so let me get this right. You sold your sidearm issued by the citizens' militia. And now a civilian is running around the streets of Martinez with it? Miraculously. I'm working on it. His face does not reveal what's happening inside. I'm sorry. I'm sorry I sold my gun. Yeah, it's not good. I do hope we manage to clean this mess up somehow. While also this mess, he means your Any where I can find this buyer? My apologies, officer. But I have a needle in a haystack. But no. Of course. That's what the hell. I doubt it, but Anything I can try to do my best to keep my distance from all manner of butchery. He doesn't know. Look, anything. I needed the money, okay? Think you could help get a corpse out of the a tree? The corpse behind the hostel, I show. I do ask around the harbor. The pool oh, worker's gaze is already fixed on the dancing colors. Um. Well, just luck. Okay. Nope. He definitely is high. Looking at his weirs, talking to him, a guarded man like him wouldn't tell you if you asked out loud. Business to take care of. Oh, I'll just leave. At least I know what happened to my gun now. Well. Here. Okay. You keep walking down the street, yes or no? Right to go. Oh. Uh. I feel like I'm hitting more dead ends. Talk to Cindy. Balcony. Cindy, do you have my gun? Hello again, officers. Have you come to admire my mural? Alright, catch you later. Well, maybe it's the other girl. Helps a lot that it unlocks rerolls for getting new info. That's cool. Where am I? Cool. I went to a different spot this time. Sleeping here. See? Right. <laughs> uh. 
up my reaction speed. I'm looking pretty ridiculous, and I'm okay with that. Okay. Where were we? Exit this way. Why don't we? Exit. Oh, we're gonna take back the time. Looking up. Again. I don't know if it'll be helpful. Just an ordinary wall. Nothing to see here. Try conceptualization. You have no clue. Okay. So many oh, I'm working on it. <laughs> I guess was this map? This looks like I think the white ones are one I can redo. On a doorbell. Measure head. Measure head. Found white checks. At the watch door. Okay, well, yeah. Um, okay, we'll talk to Kim. I had something for him. Alright, well. Calm down. Okay. Alright. Calm down. Hey. Take a gun. Try to sneak up on me again! Try to sneak up- Yes? Logic. Pick over what's left of your frontal okay, cord. nothing. Um. Save. I'm like, running out of shit to do, so... I'm gonna use my bolt cutters on the door, even though I don't really think I need to. Or I don't think I have a good excuse to, I guess I should say. This door has been closed with a padding. The shackle snaps like a twig. After you, detective. All right, well, here we go. The cast bust depicts a middle aged man. Krasmazov, nom de guerre, was an economist and a theoretical historian. He was a leading figure in the Grad side of the turn Let's of the Let's say, hero of the working class! Whoever lives here definitely shares your enthusiasm. There aren't many communists around, not after the revolution. Some youth still keep the ideology going. It's the White Star, the photos on the wall. I think we have broken into the apartment of a young communal. How fitting. Do I take these? I need broke in, so I'm like, why not? Well, maybe I'll fit in somewhere with those. This. Again, specialization. Look, I'm gonna say I'm into this thing now, you know? Who I am. We've chosen the communist path and we're sticking to it. Yeah, I just seem to take people's shit whenever and wherever and I guess I'm okay with it. Nothing in here. I've already looked at everything. Time to leave. Wait, no balcony. Let's leave. Exit. Okay. Um. Go around on Kuno's side of things. Talk to the girl. We can try the phone box thing again. I think it said I had a, a fresh white check on it. So.
No longer snowing. An old call box with a matrix of push buttons. Listen, whatever she says, it can't hurt you. You're a different person. All right. Maybe not healthier. Again. There's a light buzz as you press the doorbell. Yes, hello. This is Triton Centennial Electric. Have you come to place an order? That's me again. Here come the bad vibes again. Relax. Don't hang Distance up. Distance yourself. It's you. My God. Wait. Is she... Reading your words? Michelle. Just please. Why did you really fall? I don't... Is this some kind of joke? Doesn't matter what I say. The voice from the intercom doesn't answer, but you can hear her breathing. Ever since I came to work here, it's been as if, as if my mind... Say nothing. And then it hits you. You're she recording. tries again not to cry and still doesn't succeed completely. Her quiet sobs sound old and distant, as if real or not, your mirror neurons react. It feels painful to be listening to this. Uh, why does it still feel like it's Her my sound fault? melts into the static from a long distance phone call. From time to time, you can hear this is where you hung up the call the last time. Keep listening. The phone rings in the office with an old fashioned chime. And Anyone so there? No one replies. But the static grows stronger like rainfall. Then a female voice speaks out, completely different from the one before. Her words this game had cosmetics separate from the stats. I agree. She smells of sodium I'm going for a silly fun look. Eyes like pilot lights watch your shape in dark hallways. Got so it was a recording trapped in the circuitry from some ancient tenant. This sometimes happens. Shall we conclude here? Wait, we're recording trapped in the circuitry? Mm -hmm. no, I don't have time to explain it to you right now. Maybe sometime later. Don't take this the wrong way, but during our short stint working together, something weird is almost always happening to you. Fair enough. That is true. <laughs> All right. What's measure head? Is that the tall guy? I think so, but I don't want to conceptualize his stuff. I don't feel like beating him up either. All right, should you take my gun, kid? I'll die before I squeal, pick. You, you there. Don't fuck with me. I got my hands bloody. You can still see the top of her. Okay, well, not useful. I kind of Okay, we might do I don't want to see if they'll let me shoot this down again. I'm gonna try. The man before you is naked, but for a pair of- Dang it. Okay, nope. It won't. Fair enough. I don't know where to go. Or what to do. Won't be able to level up for 70 more experience points. So that's out of the picture. Uh. I've gone into the bookstore. Yes, something? I have. Done. Go back to the bookstore. Spend a minute. Farewell for now. The curtains, tattered with age and covered pull in... Pull open the curtain. Just as you're about to pull apart the curtains, the petrified... Sir, don't touch that. I told you it's off limits for the customers. Parapsychologically speaking, we're done if you decide to open them. I won't be held responsible. She looks away, mumbling. Why is everyone always messing with the curtains? 
Why can't they just buy books like normal um, people? Is that the no, curse? It's just a storeroom for the employees, I told you. Police that officer. Was. It's not like anyone was killed there. I am sorry, I don't mean to be so impolite. Just please don't go there. I can't allow that. You'll only make things worse and unleash the powers. Uh. You do? My god, even more reasons not to mess with the curtains. Just step away, hmm. dear sir. Thank you. Think about what it. What are you, a coward? Think about the marvelous adventures waiting for us I'm on the other side. I'm gonna listen to the necktie, because I don't know what else to do, and... There is and... something mysterious about the curtain. The curtains, tattered with age and covered in dust, hang before you, as if taunting you. We're gonna do it. You see a dimly lit room full of dusty furniture and tra- I warned you, you're unleashing for- Alright, well. A heavy door with a missing handle stands before you, covered in dozens, if not hundreds, oh. of Semenese trinkets and charms. It appears to be locked. Enough. Only an echo. No one is there. Dang, my pain threshold though seems like a bad sign. Ow. Shoot. Whose moronic idea was it to just run through the door? Don't you know please that don't cry, please like don't cry. Hurt? Um I'm gonna say that was my best Are you idea. Alright? This looks It barely looks like you've done any damage to the door, however. Uh, well, we'll try again later. Okay. So, let's buy books right now. Alright. I'm really losing my patience with this one. This might be where we wrap up today. I just can't freaking figure out what more I could do. Oh, I'm gonna take a break. Quick save. All right, who else is a streaming? Let's go raid somebody. Why don't we raid? Let's raid little Simsy. Get some Sims content. Alrighty, goodbye gamers. Thank you mods. Thank you friends. Thanks for hanging out. I should see you tomorrow. Probably not at our normal time, but I'm not sure which time yet, so I'll see you around. Goodbye!